Finland is renowned for its sea-facing landscapes, its famous design and its Nordic cuisine, but it's also a hub for medical technology and innovation. The patient care monitor was the unsung hero when it came to medical technology and the care of COVID-19 patients, and it was also critical when standing at field hospitals at the height of the pandemic. Here at GE Healthcare's Helsinki plant, the patient monitor is assembled and shipped to over 140 countries around the world. Mia Keke is a global product manager and she's responsible for making sure the monitors get to where they need to go. Mia, what's unique about this production line? This production line is designed to produce the patient monitors, which is the design center and a manufacturing center in Helsinki. And this specific uh, production line is producing the uh, product called Carescape One, which is the smallest and the newest member in the, in the monitoring family. How has demand shifted since COVID-19 for these monitors? Because they're, they're the unsung heroes, aren't they, of treating COVID-19 patients? Demand has been exploding in that sense that not only on the monitoring and the parameters relating, but especially on the volumes and need on the gas uh, technology we are providing here in Helsinki globally. And monitors are getting smaller? They are getting smaller and they are getting much more mobile so that people can move. They don't have to lay down on a bed and, and you're trying to treat the patients while they're moving, yeah. And that's massively important in COVID because obviously you're protecting patients and yes. medical staff from the uh, virus. Yes, exactly. That, that's the case, yeah. So the demand for the smaller, more mobile uh, monitors, I'm assuming, is, is going yes. up. Yes, it's, it's in a growing manner. Where are the monitors going? Once they leave this plant, where in the world are they going? Uh, from this plant, the monitors go uh, uh, everywhere, almost everywhere outside the US. So the other half, Europe, uh, Australia, New Zealand, Asia, region, EGM, and, and Africa is the one we are shipping the uh, modules worldwide. Mary Konkinen is the production team leader, and she's been overseeing the Carescape One Monitor production line for a year. Hey, Mary. Hi. This is the assembly line. Yes. What was life like pre-COVID for you, and, and how have things changed? Pre-COVID, we were producing on this particular line around 20 monitors per day, tops. Then COVID came, we're in two shifts at the moment, producing around 50 devices per day. And actually, we're looking into a third shift and trying to increase the capacity to 70. So what have you learned in the last five months? What has been sort of the big takeaway, especially when we might be looking at a second wave? For me, the biggest difference is in the amount of employees and the capacities that we have. So basically, before COVID, I had around five to 10 employees tops. At the moment, I have around 70, even 80 employees all the time. So basically I've learned how to handle that and how to increase capacities with more changes on the production line. Here we keep all our, our parts and components that we put in our products. So basically the parts, we put them in these pink kits. The pink kit goes here on the assembly line. These two production associates assemble the parts into a product that we call Carescape One, a patient monitor, which looks like this. So we have two places where we assemble the parts and the ready product comes here. After it's been assembled, we test the product, we download the software inside, we configure the product right here. And then the final touch is the product to be, to be packed. And that happens here, and after it's been packed, we ship it to the world. Historically, monitors have sat by the bedside, but as the technology evolves and monitors become smaller, untethered and mobilized, this only serves to increase the protection of not just the patients, but also the medical staff.